she told me you cannot actually record the process of making the coffee or the process of ordering this is lincoln coffee my order is not ready yet this is the guy who told the woman that i'm vlogging inside and she should actually ask me to leave but that's not the point of this video since china is very famous with green tea which means people like to drink green tea also which also means people in china don't often drink coffee with the impact of the foreigner culture chinese people try to drink coffee from time to time but not regularly so it is so normal to see chinese people in a coffee with their friends having fun and even taking pictures while for us foreigners we drink coffee because we need it but let us not say that all of chinese people don't drink coffee some drink coffee because they need coffee too so they will go with the cheaper price coffee not like starbucks and here is the topic of this video the difference between starbucks and lincoln coffee right now i'm in the subway i'm going to the first location which is the lincoln coffee hey i'm not supposed to pronounce this word as lincoln coffee i'm supposed to pronounce it as lunkin coffee i'm so sorry okay the funny part is that i have noticed the mistake at the end of the video after vlogging everything so don't mind me keep watching the video Okay, people are looking at me because I am vlogging. I'm going to pass the security right now. At this moment right now, I'm going to use the subway to, uh, yeah, it's arriving in that side, but I will take, I should take this side. That subway have arrived, but mine have not yet. I think so, four minutes left. Uh, for the subway to arrive so i have to wait for four minutes in this place with these people to enter the subway okay let me show you where is my location at where am i going to okay let me show you here i am no no here i am right now i'm going to this way then uh, wait yeah over here one two three four five six seven eight nine ten 11. After 11 stations, I will reach my destination. It will take me around 30 to 40 minutes to go to my destination. And after that, we will compare what's the difference between Starbucks and Lincoln Coffee. The point of this video is to show you that how Lincoln have overcome or overpassed Starbucks in China. Why Starbucks is a luxury product and Lincoln is not. All right, so we're gonna talk about that in this video. So subscribe if you like the video. Actually using subway in China is a little bit convenient. It's faster and cleaner and uh, yeah, I can say it's way better than uh, a lot of other countries. Really, subway can help you to go from A to B with cheap price. When you use subway in China, you have to think about the time because subways might be slower than car. They will take you to the destination on time. Uh, if you want to use subway, it's way, way better. I think so. And it's cheaper, by the way. It's cheap as hell. Most people who work in office and students and old people will love to use the public transportation in China because it's cheaper and maybe faster and yeah and env environment is very bro please learn english it's called environment if you want to know what are those yellow things those yellow things are actually for the blind people if they want to use the subway one station I will transfer to another line people are looking at me right now I'm getting off at this station right now over here to transfer to another line and then go to my destination yeah it's pretty much long why i haven't used taxi because i think so it's kind of a rush hour right now so if i use taxi i will be 10 times later plus it will be expensive so it's better that i actually use subway <laughs> So basically in the transfer line people walk like around five to two minutes to the other train because 
there are different kind of trains so they have to walk two to three minutes to reach to the other train and some people will be confused so they will have a look at this map which will guide them to the train but i guess so it's so easy because you can actually uh look at the boards up there and she's watching me you can actually look at the boards up there finally we have arrived to the mall and right now we are going to the coffee shop the first coffee shop that i'm gonna actually take you to is actually called lincoln it is a chinese coffee shop i don't know where is it right now should i use this way or this way i'm not pretty much sure but hi hello oh, hi i'm gonna go ahead and ask where is lincoln coffee i have to ask now i have to I uh, just click here in this big tablet. Oh, it's here, right? Uh, Doha. L2 to L2. Okay. I'm in L2. What the hell, man? So I'm here. So I have to walk this way. Let me just... Okay, I am... Hey, 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 don't disturb me, okay? I am here right now. In the map, I'm here right now. I should go to this place, okay? So we're gonna walk this way and we're gonna walk this way. Which means I'm gonna... Guys, I'm confused. I'm gonna walk this way, then that way. I don't know. Where the fuck am I supposed to walk, guys? Where the... Where the hell am I supposed to go? So I'm, I'm here right now, okay? I'm gonna walk this way, then this way. Yeah. Alright, so let's do it. So I'm gonna go this way, then I'm gonna go this way. This way, then this way. This way, then this way. Is that true, guys? Fuck it, I don't care, I'll go anyways. Yeah, I found it. It's over there. This is Lincoln Coffee, the coffee brand that have overpassed Starbucks in number of shops and in number of sales. That woman didn't allow me to record how do people actually place their order. So I'm gonna tell you right now. You bring your phone, you scan the QR code, you will place your order through the application. After you place your order through the application, you will wait for your number to come. You will pick up your order and that's it. No cash nothing like that i don't know why for some reason this flavor is actually one of the best flavors that they have actually produced but i think it's the worst flavor in 2020 lincoln was losing millions of dollars but gaining huge amount of people that buy this coffee people like office workers students were buying this kind of coffees not because it tastes very nice because the price was so cheap lincoln used to sell 1.4 dollar for one cup of coffee but starbucks Box, used to sell 4.5 for one cup of coffee so people like students office workers preferred Lincoln so they have actually continued in that way but they were still losing money for them to actually make coffee package and deliver and advertise was really a big thing for them they were actually buying coffee beans buying coffee packages advertising the product and also delivering was coming out from the linking coffee pockets the main idea was this people will like to always drink linking coffee not because of the coffee because of the price at that time but when linking coffee have actually raised the price they have started losing customers right the customers started to choose other brands not linking because the taste was so bad but with one strategy they have gained the customers back again you see linking have different kind of flavors right they have mixed between the coffee and what chinese people actually like as a flavor for example green tea with latte mango with latte you never heard of that but Chinese people always like to drink sweet drinks. They've made different kind of flavors for their customer. They studied their customer. They tested what flavors their customer like, what kind of coffee the customer like, what kind of flavor Chinese people prefer. And boom, out of nowhere, Lincoln have overpassed Starbucks in number of sales, number of branches, and quality in taste. See, people come here to drink coffee because they need coffee. They don't come here to drink coffee because it's a luxury place. But here in Starbucks, the story is a little bit different. People in China consider Starbucks Starbucks as a luxury brand. So they come to Starbucks during their weekends with their friends or during their shopping time, but it's not considered as a first option coffee shop or a regular coffee shop. Not like us foreigners, we go to Starbucks when we need coffee. Therefore, people in China consider Starbucks as a luxury brand. While in the other side, Lincoln is considered as a regular brand. People go often to drink coffee because they need coffee. Hey, I was talking about Starbucks. I was not talking about this car, but look at this. La la, what is this car? Oh my goodness, what is going on? Let me place over here. Oh my goodness. Oh, 
Guys, let's agree on this, okay? Let's let's agree on this that the Chinese companies are overcoming Tesla slowly. Literally, look at this car. It's super clean and super nice. See, it shows over here the many kilometers it can go, the charge and everything. Oh my god, you can watch a whole movie in this one. There is a Starbucks over here and there's this car. Ooh, what is this car? Let me enter it and see. Okay. Be gentle. Let me just lock the car. I just uh, parked my car inside the mall, guys. I'm just kidding. A lot of things that I should explore in this mall. It's a very big mall. It's literally nice. What is this car, by the way? Oh, you open it like that. God. So you, they told me to press this button. The door will automatically open, as you can see. Oh my goodness. Oh my god, this car is so low. Oh, you press here. <laughs> I thought it... Don't blame me. I thought it can close the door by itself. Oh my god. Look look how it looks from back. Yo, this is like a spaceship, bro. I don't know what is this. Let me try. I don't care. Oh! It opened the door automatically. You can just... It's closing. Okay, watch this, okay? I'm gonna open the back door, okay? Let's try this, okay? One, two, three. Oh my goodness. It has just opened. I just opened the back door. By this click, you can actually... Let's close the door, okay? Wow. I'm controlling the doors from this side. See, you can open the doors like this. See? You can open the doors from the two sides, by the way. It's very nice. The first door and the second door. And them both are closing. At the corner over there, there's a Starbucks, and here is a McLaren, as you can see. Get my point? Starbucks in China became so fancy, it cannot be anywhere. It should be in a place where there is fancy things. McLaren, Starbucks at the corner. You get my point? Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching this vlog. Hopefully you have enjoyed each and every single minute of the vlog. If you like the video, subscribe, like, and share, and hopefully you enjoy it. See you next time. Peace.